What's up, guys? I was going to check in real quick. Uh, just got finished doing some chest and back. It was a pretty good workout. Like, I don't know. I don't think I've ever said this uh, on video, but I do everything twice a week. So, got three exercises in for chest and back. Did bench press, push-ups, flies with uh, T-bar rows, a high and low, and uh, what else did I do? Oh, rows. Seated rows. So, it was a good day. But the main thing I was want to talk about is uh, starting my cut. That's the big news right now. So I'm going to be documenting it right now. My weight is 230 and I'm 14% body fat. So by the time this all ends, hopefully I'll be at uh, single digits at 205 to 210. So we're going to put Nick McIntyre's abilities to the test on this. Now keep in mind, I'm going to show you what I'm doing, but it will not work for you know everybody's body's different you have to get with somebody so they can cater it to you but this is a small look at what nick's you know got me doing for now and i'll hopefully i'll have it printed out so you can see what i'm doing every day like my macros i'm just general macros three times a week 40 minutes of cardio and uh you know keep my workouts the same so let's take a look oh yeah look at that you can tell it's cutting time Let's open the lunch box. Look at that. We got some almonds, oven roasted, sea salt, canned tuna. Did not mean to get it in vegetable. That kind of upset me. Hot sauce for flavor. Uh, early morning training sessions. And uh, we got, just for some fats, some Kalamata olives. I don't eat many of those, but, you know. And right here is my canned chicken for after my workout. Oh, and here, let me show you this. Well, let's get this focus. There we go. You might not be able to uh, really understand what this is saying, but right now, today, I have 100 carbs, 200 proteins, and 65 fats. And tomorrow, also, I won't get any like this. Tomorrow, normally I'd get a refeed day, but since this is the first week I'm doing it, I'm skipping that because I got to be depleted before I can do that. Saturday and Sunday, lower. And of course, you know, I'm going to keep my aminos to a limit just because, you know, recent research and everything like that. So, Nick McIntyre, for real, giving him a shout out for uh, setting that up for me. Well, here it is, guys. Like I said, I was going to. Uh, Try to get this to you as soon as possible, but Nick gave it to me today, so we're going to get a good or a better look at it, which it's not looking too bad. Look at that. Now, uh, keep in mind, I, I can't stress this enough, that everybody's body is different. Nick has made this diet specifically for my body, my body fat, and my workload and everything like that. So keep in mind, if you want to try this, it would be much more beneficial if you uh talk to nick himself but yeah look at that monday wednesday thursday friday monday wednesday thursday friday on my training days now i do have a six day workout split right now and uh oh look at that 30 minutes of car oh dang gum stair climber oh <laughs> but yeah that's not that's not bad at all look at that i don't know if you can see it but look at that Total carb. Now let me try to decipher this for you. Monday, Wednesday, th Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. On those training days, I get 125 carbs, total protein, th 200, and total fat, 60. Of course, meals one through four. These are what the breakdowns are going to look like. And then three and four are my pre and post workout. And then meal five, I get zero carbs, which is at night. My refeed day is on my main leg day. I, like I said earlier, my splits, I do everything twice a week. And of course, I get, you know, 300 carbs, 200 proteins, 50 fats to drop that down. And he breaks it down here again, meal one through five, 50 carbs, 40 proteins, 10 fat, ten fats. And then Saturday and Sunday, my off day, you know, off days. So drop it way low, 75 carbs, 200 proteins, 60 fats. And then, of course, you know, it breaks it down through here or right there of how you're going to uh, eat them. And then he says, make sure to consume 25 to 40 grams of fiber daily. Make sure to drink one gallon of water daily. And if you're under or over your macros, add or subtract them from your next. So it does not roll over daily. It rolls over, meal, ro rolls over meal wise. So I can get these totals throughout the day. It might, uh, 
he just gave me the straight macros because I, you know, I mean, I know how to do it, but I'm just letting him coach me through this because he, he knows a whole lot more than I do. But, uh, yeah, this looks really, you know, of course he said that we're going to go back and look at it about a, you know, a month in, depending on how much weight I lose, possibly up to 10 pounds. And uh, we're going to see. But, like I said, I was just going to let you guys see this. And depending on where this goes in the video, this could be the end or you'll see me saying bye to you at the gym. So, I'll see you guys around. I'm excited. We're going to see what he can do. Like I said, I'm going to document this and, you know, show my progress. And at the end, you know, maybe put up before and after pictures. So, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Remember, this is Iron Sharpens Iron. I'm Kaz James.